I've been asked about the uh, one and a half horsepower Spencer machine that I actually have hooked up uh, to my garage vacuum system. And here it is. It's a portable unit from the probably 1950s. And um, it's got a universal motor with brushes made by Lamb Electric. It's under here. <clears throat> There's the nameplate. The Lamb Electric Company, Kent, Ohio. One and a half horsepower, continuous duty, 16 amps, 7,200 RPM. And uh, that's hooked up to the Spencer fans in here. I think this might be probably only two fans. And originally it had a big long cord on it and you would just plug it in and hit the switch. Since I've got it set up as a central vacuum, uh, I put it on this uh, relay box here with a transformer and um, there's a relay in there and this you can turn it on and this little box over here is a latching relay which allows me to have uh, we've actually got one of the inlets that's a push button inlet and so and up here's the filter you take this off And then you can shake this out and the dirt falls into the bin without you having to get dirty. Lots of surface area, so even though it does have a cloth filter, it holds its airflow quite well as the, as the thing fills up. And then the bucket is down here. You raise the handle and pull that out. We've got a good amount of stuff in there. This is an aluminum dirt can. It's on little rollers, so you can move it around. And there's up inside the thing, the filter. <clears throat> and we're back. Uh, anyway, things got pretty good suction. It's got about 70 inches of water lift. It's probably moving 200 CFM and it sounds very unique because it's not an induction motor and it's also not a modern high speed uh, universal motor for a central vac. So it's it sounds strange, different from a typical vacuum. And there you have it.